those of you who don't know, I spent years uh, working in museums, building displays and mounts for, for museum objects. Um, I still do that every once in a while in my own shop. And this week I was contacted by the Natural History Museum here in Seattle, and uh, they requested that I build a mount for this Salish canoe paddle. They're using it for educational purposes, so they're gonna bring it to schools and things like that. Um, they had three requests for the design, that it be transportable, lightweight, and that when the paddle is on the stand itself, it's easy to remove. So I've come up with a design and we'll see how it goes. film most of this on camera but it um, it was just super finicky so this was my first measured piece I've made a prototype here on the bandsaw with a little bit of sanding I got it to fit but these aren't wide enough so I'm gonna cut one more and it's gonna be just a little bit wider here do this if you feel comfortable with it. I've got the blade raised completely because I want to minimize the angle that it leaves inside of the cut. Once it's in, I will shut off the saw, set up a stop block here on the fence, and then I can repeat that cut over and over again to this same spot right here.
So I've managed to get a really nice finish on this. Um, I'm super happy with that. And the parts slip in and out pretty easily. Uh, like that, yeah. And one of the things that I was kind of going back and thinking about was that, you know, they wanted this thing to be transportable. It's nice, uh, it comes apart, but it's a little awkward to carry all three parts together. Um, so I was looking around the shop and things that I might have that might make it easier. I was playing around with how the parts might go together. I went to my local fabric store and they have this, which is, um, it's white Velcro, which has the hook on one side and the loop on the other side. So you can use it to strap things to. So I think what I'm going to do is on the underside of this, attach some of this Velcro. <laughs> It's a little bit of a strange build, but it could totally be used as a guitar stand. And it's really funny, no adjustments necessary, it totally fits. Um, the Velcro works super well, it was kind of like a last minute add-on, and I really love it. It's going to make it a lot easier for, for them to carry around. I built another project for them this week as well. Unfortunately, I didn't have time to record a video of the build for this, just not enough time. But it's a prize wheel built from scratch. You can see this on my Instagram. So um, I, I highlighted it in my stories, the whole build. So if you, you're curious how this thing was made, go check that out there. Um, yeah, if you guys have any questions on this, uh, feel free to ask them in the comments down below. Uh, pick up a t-shirt, I've got them in the shop now. And uh, yeah, I'll catch you guys on the next one. Thanks a lot, bye. <laughs>